soul's voice chills you to the bone. It speaks with a deep, resonating bitterness. You cannot make out a great deal of its face, but what you can see has the hairs on the back of your neck standing on end. In life, I would row this boat for the master. Long ago was my untimely death in these waters. But still, I remember many things. Yes. Laughter. Tears. Joy. Pain. Uh, let's talk to him a little bit more. M may I cross, Sir Boatman? You have come to raid the Master's house. This I know, but care not about. You should be warned, though. The master is not what he once was. Never has this land known a kinder, more compassionate, and nobler ruler than he. But his fate has long since been decided. Down the dark path he now treads, and he feels naught for anyone, nor anything, save for one other. And even that is a rare trait for a Nosferatu. You freeze. Neither the door of destiny nor Neptune mentioned this count as being. Okay, so we got our pea shooter. Now it's time to talk to the ferry boat uh, pilot. If I may or, ask, uh, Sir Boatman, how did this the boatman come to be? And here? it appears to Is be. He reminds me natural? of uh, the boatman in the uh, River no, Styx. So let's speak to him. Stand upon was once farming land and dwellings for the peasantry. Okay. How did it come to be like this? A score of years Ooh. passed after the master died and a great morass opened up, covering the surrounding land with slime and poisoned water. Once rich and fertile, now it is no longer. Ooh. The Count has caused this? It is believed so, for why else would his own castle be spared? Ah, thank you, Sir Boatman. The Boatman has nothing more to say. The Boatman has <laughs> nothing more to say. That is creepy, man. No All right, let's way. talk to him some more. The Boatman does not consider that a form of payment. The Boatman accepts your payment and motions for you to climb into the boat. The shrouded ghoul passes We're heading across the top of Count Caldor's castle. We've made it, guys. We've made it to the castle. Save the our progress. And rambles are sharp. This All right, here we go. Is cold and ominous. Up ahead, dark towers rise from a sinister castle. The path leading up to the entrance is lined with deadly thorns and thick brambles. All right, let's save our progress. As thorns. Because we've got to watch out for those thorns. What happens when I grab one of those thorns? You feel a heavy coldness run through your entire body. Ah. Soon you are unable to stand. Finally, even your eyes become too heavy to keep open, and they close for the last time. Ouch! You feel the sharp. So when you touch one of your them, skin. your vision blurs and you begin to feel lightheaded. 
you feel a heavy coldness run through your entire... Alright, I have to be very careful here. Those thorns are poisonous. Take it easy. Take it slow. Ouch. You feel the sharp brambles graze your skin. Your vision blurs and you begin to feel light. Ah, again. You feel a heavy coldness run through you. Let's do this again. The shrouded ghoul looks very frightening. His hands are little more than claws, and his face is nearly completely hidden inside the hood of the shroud. He is waiting to ferry you back to the other side of the poisonous lake. The boatman has nothing more to say. Talk to him one more time. Alright, let's go. Ouch! You feel the sharp... Careful. Take it slow. You feel Slowly. Like cold ah! You're in Again? Alright. Take it easy now. Slowly. Alright. Take it easy. Take it easy. Take it easy. 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 Easy, 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 easy. We did it, guys. We made it to the entrance. All right. Uh, save our progress is Vampire Castle. Enter. Um, castle the doors. To the castle is a set of heavy wooden doors. Let's look around here. What do we got here? Solid. It also looks to be entirely unwelcoming. The ghosts waver as if being threatened by even the slightest. Who are these guys? It's creepy. Something holds them in place. Ghosts. It may be nothing more than an intensely strong combination, <coughs> a sense of purpose that keeps the spirits anchored to this world. The ghosts waver as if being threatened by even the slightest breeze. Ugh. Yet something holds them in place. It may be nothing more than an intensely strong determination or sense of purpose that keeps the spirits anchored to this world. What happens if we go away here? Can't go this way? Can't go that way? Can you go the other way? Tombs and crypts line the edge of this rundown cemetery. Though once grand and noble, years of neglect have obviously taken their toll on them. Ooh. Mary Ann Drinkwater, 1230 to 1266. Let's look at these graves. They traveled safely for many a day until crossing a bridge along their way. She lost her balance and fell to her fate. He tried to save her, but it was too late. Douglas Buckmaster, 995 <coughs> Sad. to Okay, moving the on. The noise, said he, is far too loud, as he discerned the maddened crowd. The mob broke in, and he did scream, <coughs> I'd rather this a sight unseen. They strung him up from toe to head, and as for after, enough's been said. Douglas Buckmaster, 995 to 1020. The noise, said he, is far too loud, as he discerned the maddened crowd. The mob broke in, then he did scream, I'd rather this a sight unseen. All right. 1500 to 1510. This is crazy. Sudden did the illness come upon sweet Kitty, no longer young. Aww. There is nothing more that can be done. Her lives are up. She's had her fun. Lord Herbert and Lady Lillian, okay. 1646 to 1668. Loving parents of Anastasia, 
Hmm. Beloved son and daughter-in-law of Count Kaldor and Countess Lavidia, our enemies be warned. Their untimely deaths shall be avenged. Hmm. Lord Herbert and Lady Lillian, 1646 to 1668, loving parents of Anastasia, beloved son and daughter-in-law of Count Kaldor and Countess Lavidia, our enemies be warned. Their untimely deaths shall be avenged. Lord Herbert and Lady, the path has become worn and degraded over time. This grave is centrally located within the cemetery. A stone guard is atop it. You see the name on the headstone in Swallow Hard. It says Count Kaldar. Died sixteen forty six. Though you did not think it possible, you suddenly feel a lot colder. Six. King of Siam, date Ooh. of death, forty seven. His death was a puzzlement. Tombs and crypts line the edge of this run-down cemetery. Though Indeed. once grand and noble, years of neglect have obviously taken their toll on them. It's you, King Graham of Dav... King of Siam, this cemetery is one of the creep... gnarled, twisted... tombs and... Most of these tombs are the final resting places of past counts of Kalima and their families. They are all securely locked. Anything else around here to explore? Susanna Somnia, 1195 to 1265. He had put her to bed after she'd had supper, but forgot next morning to stir and wake up her. Uh. The main entrance to the castle is a set of heavy wooden doors. All right, looks what's this place? Solid. It also looks to be entirely unwelcoming. As you approach the ghosts wearing the black cloak, so what happens if we try to open the door? And then begin to drift away towards the cemetery. Okay. Why are they doing that? The ghosts waver. They're at the cemetery. Why are they doing that? Can we talk to when them? You speak to the ghosts. They utter a mournful wail. Ooh. What are you gonna say? When you speak to the ghosts, they utter a mournful wail. As you step me, uh, face into them. the cemetery, you can feel your life force slowly being sucked away by the disembodied spirits. You suddenly find yourself unable to move. Uh-oh. The ethereal spirits drain the life force come. right out of your body. You tup with the spirits and find only the graves. Ah. Uh. Not a good idea. As you deal with spirits into the like cemetery, that, I guess we have to you feel your life force slowly look being at the graves? sucked away by the disembodied spirits. You suddenly find yourself unable to move. The ethereal spirits drain the life force. You tup with the spirits and find... Alright, I have to stay away from those ghosts. Until the I have more information. The castle is a set of heavy wooden doors. It looks to be fairly solid. It also looks to be entirely unwelcoming. Hmm. As you reach to push the massive doors open, let's open the door. As there are no handles, the only thing visible is a small keyhole, which slightly resembles a cross. Aha! That will 
foolproof hail fall. There's a shiny silver cross dangling from Let's look at the cross tree. we have, our necklace, crucifix. You remove the cross from around All your right. neck. Grab our chain and enter into. Having an idea, you push the crucifix into the cross-shaped keyhole. Enter into the lock. Fits. You hear a click and the door unlocks. Of course. Click. You push the heavy wooden door open. Take Excellent. a deep breath and step Let's nervously open inside the, door. the castle entrance. The moment you enter the great hall, Here we of the go, castle, guys. you begin shivering uncontrollably. Entering the castle, and not just from the cold. This place has an air of death wherever you go. As if creeping around this huge castle was not enough, knowing full well that an undead creature resides here would unnerve even the most stout-hearted of adventurers. You feel desperate to get what you came for Ooh. and anxious to leave as quickly as possible. Right, let's save our progress. Ah, inside castle, castle Caldor. Castle C. All right, let's put our crucifix back on. Maybe we can protect ourselves. You place the silver cross and chain around your neck and wear it as a necklace. All right. We're going to take a little break, gamers, because we are he we are going to uh, have an adventure in Ca Count Caldor's castle in our next episode. For now, let's take a break. Because we truly believe it's our web, and we need to fix it together. So ask yourself this question. Do you want a web browser made for the Internet of today? If so, try Brave. It's faster, safer, and ad-free. It's easy to support Video Gamers Oasis Play Theater. Download the Brave browser. Click on the link, https colon forward slash forward slash brave.com forward slash vid 610